Hi, I'm Michael Nadalin from Market Lead, and today's video is about how to quickly and easily set up the Microsoft Ads base code or the UET code. Now, the reason why I'm doing this video is because I've had a few people reach out to me and ask me about this over the last probably few months, so it hasn't been that recently, but I thought I'm going to do a bit more content around Microsoft Ads because I'm noticing a lot more clients working with it. So I'll just start off with the basics around tracking. So this video is basically how to just set up the base code, which would be called the pixel if you're using Facebook or just in Google Ads, the base tag. So what you need to do is go up to tools and I'm just hiding that up here and you go to the UET tag. Now we click on that and what you wanna be doing is up here, you just press create and you're gonna be creating a new code. So for this one, I'm in an account called market lead so i might just call it market lead base code and you can add a description i might even just copy that there now you can add microsoft clarity i'm just going to turn that off because that's a separate product that i actually use with nearly all of my clients but for this i'm just not going to use it uh it will only be used by market lead and then i'll just go down to here let me just actually reshape this so you can see it all and then save and next so this is where you get to install it. Now I'm going to do it in the way that you can do it. So you could either send it to a developer, uh, add it through the website, through your editing, which is quite simple, add through Google Tag Manager just by integrating it. But I'm going to show you how to actually do it just in case you don't know how to. So I'm going to do install the tag yourself. So click here, next, and here is the code. So I'm going to press copy tag. So that will just copy that whole tag here. Now the next thing I want to be doing is I'm going to jump into my test Google Tag Manager account here. And what I'm gonna do is just create a new tag and then new triggers. So I'm going to call this Microsoft uh, Ads Base Code or UET. And then I'll go to Tag Configuration, Custom HTML, and then paste the code there. And the trigger I wanna be using is all pages because this is the base code or like the remarketing tag or whatever you wanna call it that will go across all the pages, which is the most important part. And you can also put the ID in there if you want, just for labeling purposes. So there's a, if we go to next and press done, we will get the ID. So if you do wanna have the ID in there as well, uh, it should be showing some, oh, there we go, tag ID. I might just copy that is if I go in here, it might just make it a bit easier for any sort of just making it look well. So press save and there we go. And then we press submit, publish and continue. And once that is done, we will be done. Excellent. So there you go. So this, as you saw when we're publishing the tag uh, just through here before, uh, save and then we go install the tag yourself next, next. It said it will take about 24 hours uh, for us to verify your UET tag. So there you go. It's quite simple, quite straightforward. If you need to do this in the back end of your website, there will be easy guides. You'll just need to add it to the header code. But most of the time, just add Google Tag Manager to your website and just add all your codes through there. You'll have a better experience. So I'll leave it there. The next two videos are about how to set up lead conversions on Microsoft Ads. Have a great day. If you've got any questions, please let me know. But remember, like, comment, subscribe, but most importantly, share. If you've enjoyed this video, remember to like, comment, subscribe, but most importantly, share. And if you're ready to become a market leader and you're serious about increasing your sales, increasing your customers, and scaling your business with Google Ads, have a chat with someone at my team about your Google Ads account at marketlead.com.au. 